Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Eileen with Unique Gifts and Decor by Lady Die. Happy Tuesday to everyone. I'm hoping you guys have enjoyed your day or enjoying your day. It is early for me here. I know once y'all probably look at this video in the evening time, the day might be already over. But nevertheless, you guys, it is a wonderful day here in North Carolina. The weather is really nice this morning. Um, I know they're saying that we should have some little showers scattered throughout the day. But, you know, I guess kind of we need some rain because we haven't had any rain in a while. But nevertheless, you guys, it is Tuesday. It is Election Day. Finally, it's here, you guys. I just advise all of you guys to go vote. Some of us have already done our early vote and got that out the way. But uh, we will, after tonight, we will know who our next president is. We will ha stop seeing all this negativity, these campaigns, negativity, all these ads, all this rhetoric, okay? It will be cease, okay? But um, other than that, you guys, um, on my morning nudge this morning, in our cir sister circle, um, Lady Leah was talking about, um, well, we're doing the 21-day uh, journey. So we're going back to the basics. So we're on day five. And today five was, it is well. It is well day, okay? And it kind of coordinates to what today is election day. Despite whoever you vote for, Democrat, Republican, Independent, whatever party affiliation that you may be in, it is well. God is in control, okay? He has been in our past. He is in our present, and he is definitely in our future. We're not there yet, but he's there. He's in tomorrow, and we're not even there in tomorrow. We're still in today, okay? He is an awesome, powerful, all-knowing God. He knows what's getting ready to come down the pipeline. He knows who's going to win the election before we even know. We just got to trust, believe, and stand on his word. As long as we're doing our part in the natural, God will do the super, okay? Okay? God has brought us through so much, like she was saying this morning, it is well, whatever the situation is, not just this election, in life, in our finances, in our health, in our careers, in our family, y'all, God is in control. We see so much things that are happening, the good, the bad, the ugly, God is in control. All is well, all is well. Sometimes it's hard for us to put a smile on our face when we say that. But if you put that in your spirit and you know who you belong to and who your heavenly father is, when I say look back in the past, look back and see what he's brought you and me from. He brought us through COVID, you guys. COVID. Some people didn't make it through COVID. But he had his hands all around us. Even though we could not go out and do the things that we usually do, stores was closed, businesses was closed, just the essentials was open. Hardware stores, grocery stores, maybe some restaurants, maybe. But if they were, they were takeout or delivery. But look what he brought us through, you know? And sometimes we just need to be put in a position where we have to stop. We get so busy with life, okay? Everything's microwave, boom, boom, boom. But I believe, and this is my belief, nobody else's but mine. I believe God brought COVID to get our attention. A lot of people say, well, it started in China, man made all this and that. Okay. Man cannot go all over the world like God can. Even if it started in one country. That person who started it in China, they couldn't travel all over all these different continents to infect people, okay? Think about it, okay? Make it make sense. I believe God was trying to get our attention. Some of us got it. <laughs> some of us drew closer to him, and some of us didn't. But you still got an opportunity. You still got a chance. As long as you got breath in your body, God is still drawing you to him, okay? So if he brought us through COVID, y'all, and that was a deadly disease, and we're still standing, y'all, he can, he can do anything. So again, all is well. It's easy three words to say, but have that put in your spirit. 
all is well. Your finances are going to be well. Your health is going to be well. Your children are going to be well. Your family is going to be well. Your job is going to be well. All your bills are going to be paid. It is well. Hallelujah. God said it. Stand on his word, you guys. I am standing on promises. I haven't seen them all manifest fest yet. Maybe you have been in that same situation, but you know what? You got to wake up with expectancy. All is well. Y'all, <laughs> that hit me this morning. Everything's not great. Not with me. Probably not with you, but don't wallow in it. It's things that you can do, you do the natural. When you do the natural, as I tell y'all, he will do the super, okay? In the natural, if you need to get out of debt to get where you're going to do, go move forward, get out of debt. I shop, as Sean always say, I shop in the stores. Yes, but I strategically shop. I'm not out here buying everything, clearing shelves and all that. To me, that is, oh, I can't do that. I could, but I'm not. Because if you've got inventory and you've not used all that up, to me, it doesn't seem right to buy more. That's just me. Other people may be bit thinking differently. But I think I've got enough so I can get to, out of, of these events, that are, these vendor events, and then Christmas, and then I'm going to work on Valentine's Day. But if I miss a sale now, another one's right around the corner. And maybe that sale wasn't for me, nor was it for you. But let's, like Sean always said, Pay your bills, okay? That comes first. You need a roof over your head. You need to have your lights on. You need to have your cell phone. You never know. Who to be in a house with no cell service and an, and an emergency come up? Y'all make it make sense. But anyway, I didn't mean to get on that tantrum today, but y'all, all is well, okay? So I want to show y'all this concept that I had put together on Sunday. Haven't had a chance to show you guys yet because I've just been busy. I've been decorating. I've been getting ready for this event that's coming up next week. And life, I'm life and life is happening, okay, all around me. But I've still got to do what I need to do. And I want to show y'all these concepts. So this is one of the concepts that I have put together. It's one of the totes that we got from the Family Dollar early part of the summer. I ended up putting one of my um, throws that I got from the Dollar Journal that's got these uh, pom-poms and I cascaded, I folded it for the cascade down the side here. I've got my little uh, bear that I got from Timu. All my bears came in. I hadn't shown y'all the last haul. They're all my gray ones. The um, It's like a teal color ones. They're all here. I just haven't had a chance to show you guys. But anyway, all my bears are here. This is the purple bear. This is the little small bear here. Um, I do have the body uh, products that we got from Roses here. This is the body butter and the lotion. This is one of the little sprays that we got from Roses as well. Got my loofah here, the purple loofah. I always adorn it with some kind of uh, embellishment. And this is a gray rose that a gray rose that I got from Timu. This is one of the pair of socks that I got from. Um, oh yeah, what did I get from? I got them from uh, the dollar of uh, the family dollar. So I am going to shrink wrap this right quick, you guys. Now, I don't know what size bag this is, and I'm sorry to tell you guys, but I have all my bags in my den over there uh, between me uh, working on things in my garage and got all my bags ready for these events. I don't know what size it is, and um, I do apologize, um, but they're all over the place, so I can't give y'all that information at this time, so I do apologize. But right now, my house is not up to par because half of the rooms are decorated, half of them not. Half of them got Christmas stuff in there, half of them got fall stuff in there. Y'all, it's chaotic, but it's well. 
<laughs> so let me just shrink wrap this right quick. Alrighty, so this is how it's looking so far. I've got one of these bows that I just made. I made my bows last night, you guys. That's how behind I've been on here. So, um, we're going to add this here. Now, this purple ribbon um, is not wired, okay? So, you can add wired ribbon with non-wired ribbon into your bow dabber when you're making your bows. And I think I've shown you guys how to do that on previous of my bow um, tutorials, but you can definitely go back and check those out if you like. So I think it turned out real cute, you guys, here, okay? Very, very light, not heavy um, gift set to put together for one of your customers. Doesn't have to be for Christmas. It can be for any occasion. Because it has the bear in there, it can be for Valentine's Day. But thank you guys for watching this video. Please like, share, comment. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do. Um, I am going to do a giveaway because I made, I have hit 4,000 subscribers. Um, and it will be, um, everybody's suggesting that I'm doing giveaway a bow dabber, which is, would be great, okay, since I showed you guys about the bow dabber. So I'm going to do that along with some ribbon. And I might end up doing some cash. So I want to do three uh, gifts besides the bow dabber and ribbon and do something else. It might be cash or something else. I have to fi figure out how to do this. So it's going to be coming before in within the next week or so. And I got to figure out how I'm going to do it. But I am going to give away because I do appreciate all my subscribers. So thank you again for watching this channel. Please like, share, comment. Till the next video, definitely go out and vote. Bye-bye.